Free cancer screenings for Lansing area firefighters who put their lives on the line for us every day. Good evening. I'm Ann Emmerich. And I'm David Andrews. According to the CDC, cancer is the leading cause of death among firefighters because they're exposed to a lot of different chemicals on the job every single day. News 10's Jordan Burrell was at the screening today and joins us now from the newsroom to tell us more. Jordan. David, firefighters are the first to run into fires and risk their lives to help save those in need. But the long-term health effects just from doing their job could be even more dangerous if they aren't taking the steps to get screened. Firefighters are known to have digestive cancers, oral cancers, bladder cancers and lung cancers in addition to skin. Sparrow Hospital's Herbert Herman Cancer Center partnered with Lansing area firefighters to get them free skin cancer screenings. Jenna Gutierrez, the firefighter behind the event, had her own scare with breast cancer. When I went to the doctor like five years ago, I asked for um, cancer screenings and the doctor told me, you know, you're, you're a young woman, you're super healthy, you don't need these screenings. They sent me home with a flu shot and then five years later I had stage four cancer. Gutierrez worked with a Sparrow nurse, Gina Sisson, to start this event and stresses the importance of early cancer detection. If you can catch it early, uh, then it can be removed very easily and quickly, uh, but the longer that it is prolonged and it can go into the body system and it can be really hard to treat. Sisson lost her husband to skin cancer. She says early detection is the key to survival and can change your treatment drastically. He um, got it caught at stage three, and at that point we did treatment and for someone that was so young. However, the earlier detection is so is so important because it, it really does save lives. Lives of firefighters like Jenna Gutierrez, who is in remission and is now advocating for all firefighters to get screened no matter what. Raising that awareness within the medical community, raising it within uh, our department so that we can do better to protect ourselves and others and then even at the legislation level um, so we can get some, some laws in place that help to protect us. 75 firefighters were screened at the event today. They were screened from head to toe by dermatologists and oncologists. If something is found, it gets removed and biopsied to determine whether further treatment is needed. Live in the newsroom, I'm Jordan Burrell, News 10.